Hi, hello dear students. Welcome to our channel Maths with Panindra. In this video, we are discussing about uh, theory of equations as well quadratic equations. Let us have a discussion the question here. If the sum of all the roots of the equation e power 2x minus 11 e power x minus 45 e power minus x plus 81 by 2 equal to 0 is log p to the base e then the value of p is equal to so is log p to the then the value of p is equal to so how to calculate it so first the given quadratic equation whatever equation is given you write it so what are the equation e power 2x minus 11 e power x minus 45 e power minus x plus 81 by 2 equal to 0 here multiplying on both sides with the e power x why because here e power minus x is there no i want to cancel it so each and every term both sides multiplying by e power x so e power 3x minus 11 e to e power 2x minus 45 plus 81 e power x by 2 is equal to 0. So now take LCM and simplify. You will get 2 e power 3x minus 22 e power 2x minus 90 plus 81 e power x equal to 0. Okay. Now, 2 into e power 3x can be written as e power x whole power 3 minus 22 into e power 2x can be written as e power x whole square plus 81 into e power x minus 90 equal to 0. If we take that e power x as p, let e power x equal to p then the above equation will becomes 2 e, e power x is p no so p cube minus 22 p square plus 81 p minus 90 equal to 0 it is a cubic equation dear students so here by trial and error method p value first term if we take p equal to 1 lhs is not equal to 0 and lhs if we substitute p value 1 is not satisfied so if you take p is equal to minus 1 is also not satisfied so after Taking 1 and minus 1, next 2 and minus 2. So p is equal to 2 if you substitute. It satisfies. See here, 8. Here, 22 into 4. 88. 8 to the 16. So here, 16 minus 88 plus 162 minus 90. Minus 88 minus 90 minus 178. 16 and 162 is also 178. So 178, 178 is 0. We are getting no. So P equal to 2 is satisfied. So whenever P is equal to 2 satisfied, 2 equal to P equal to 2 is one of the root of the cubic equation. So, by using Harnos synthetic method, we can here P equal to 2 by using Harnos synthetic division. 2, the method you know, 2 minus 2, 22, 81 and minus 90. So, here first put 0 and add these two. 2, 2 is a 4. Here minus 18, minus 18 into 2, minus 36. Next here. Here 45 will come here. 45 into 2 90. So 90 minus 90 is 0. So now it is a quadratic equation. 
P is equal to 2 root means P minus 2 into 2P square minus 18P plus 45 is equal to 0. So for this uh, we need to calculate the roots. So P is equal to 2 is already a root. We got it. Next come to this is the quadratic equation in terms of P. So P equal to minus B means minus of minus 18 plus or minus root over B squared 18 squared 324 minus 4 into 19 divided by 2A that means 2 into 2, 4 18 plus or minus root minus 36 divided by 4 which is equal to 18 plus or minus 6i divided by 4. So how will you are getting minus 6i? So 36 minus means i square. We will bring outside it will become as i. So to take common and simplify p is equal to here are right dear students anyway this is there now. So one p value is 2 and another set of p values p equal to here 2 take common here 9 plus or minus 3i divided by 4. So 2 ones, 2 twos. So which is equal to 9 plus or minus 3i by 2. So total 3 values of p. So p equal to 2, p equal to 9 plus 3i by 2 and p value 9 minus 3i by 2. I hope everyone understand that. After getting p value, p is nothing but what? e power x. So, e power x is equal to 2. So, x is equal to log 2 to the base e. So, one of the factor for the given quadratic cubic equation is x. Again, e power x is equal to 9 plus 3i divided by 2. So, x equal to log of 9 plus 3i divided by 2 to the base e. Second value of x. Similarly, third value. So, e power x is equal to 9 minus 3i by 2. So, x equal to log of 9 minus 3i divided by 2 to the base e. So these are the three roots of the given cubic equation. So they are asking to find the sum of all the roots. Therefore, sum of all the roots. Is equal to. It is first x1. Plus x2. Plus x3. These are all I am considering x1, x2, x3. So what is x1 here? log 2 to the base e plus x2 value log 9 plus 3i divided by 2 to the base e plus log 9 minus 3i divided by 2 to the base e we know that the formulas in the logarithms log a plus log b plus log c equal to log a b c so which is equal to log of 2 into 9 plus 3i divided by 2 into 9 minus 3i divided by 2 to the base e. Here 2 will, here 2 will be cancelled. Log sum of all the roots is equal to given as what? Log p to the base e is equal to. So log of a plus b into a minus b. a square minus b squared. So 9 square minus 3i whole square means 9i squared divided by 2 to the base e. So log p to the base e is equal to log of i square value minus 1. So minus into minus plus log 90 divided by 2 to the base e. That is equal to log 45 to the base e log p to the base c. So comparing both the logarithms 
that implies P equal to 45. Therefore, the value of P is 45. It is there in the first option, dear students. I hope everyone understand. This type of questions uh, they are asking in JMNs or MSET. So be practice, dear students, these type of questions. In our channel, regularly we keep two to three videos. We keep three or four different type of questions like in integration, differentiation, quadratic equations, theory of equations, logarithm, thirds, different concepts. So you already know about our channel. So those who are watching this channel, another channel is also there exclusive for CBSC and JMNs, that math, J, CBSC classes. That also you can follow dear students. I will give the link of another channel in the description box. Please do share and like and subscribe to that channel also. Thank you all for your support.